Everybody, it's Trent Austin from Austin Custom Brass. Hope you're having a great day out there today. Uh, I wanted to follow up with another um, subscriber who asked me a question about bends and the way that Caruso method sort of talks a little bit about bends. Now, I'm not sure this is actually in the Caruso book. Uh, Bob Finley showed me this when I was young at the main jazz camp about when you're picking up your horn and trying to find the center of your note. So what I would suggest for you is sim it's really simple. Find a, op a second line G. If that's where you think it is, slowly bend the note up and down until you find the most resonant part of your horn. I love doing that for myself because it helps me really get into the center of my instrument. And I think most of us, a great percentage of us play high on the pitch. In other words, we're reaching up to the note versus letting the note just happen. Instead of hitting that right off the center, we often do this. I don't know if you could hear that on this. I'm, this microphone's not that good, so I don't know if you can hear where we relax into the sound of the note versus hitting the center right at the beginning. Certain ways that helped me over overcome that are doing attacks with no tongue breath attacks so like a those are that's a breath attack or like a little who and then eventually doing a like a poo attack which is magic I'm even doing a poo attack on that top G. And that, for me, if I could do a really good poo attack, and then literally it's this, P-I-U, pew. Um, if I could do that, then I can find the center of my embouchure really quick. And I also feel like I'm not overshooting the note. And that's helped my efficiency greatly, especially owning a shop and selling trumpets. I don't get the time to practice like I used to. So it's very important for me to do the, these things. Hope you enjoyed this quick little tutorial. If you have questions about this, and you probably are will are probably going to have some, because this is a very short information video, stay tuned for our next live session on YouTube, which will be coming up soon, probably uh, first week of March. And if you have a second, hit that subscribe button right there to stay tuned with all of our new um, mini lessons and product demonstrations. Thanks again for watching our videos. Take care.